Hi and welcome to my video about how you can use Book Creator to create learning journals for young people to track their progress and some of the creative things that they've been doing in class. Um, so when you open up Book Creator, this is the kind of screen that you, you get. I'm going to show you just how I've used it in my S2 class. So for our topic in our unit, we looked at a Christmas craft fair. Um, and we got young people to kind of document their journey um, and some of the things that they had learned and how they worked well with other people. So Book Creator allows you to add photos, it can allow you to add in text uh, and it can allow you to kind of reflect on your learning and it can also allow you to add videos as well. So um, any kind of creative activities you can record it um, and display it on your Book Creator. Um, so how do we start creating a kind of template that we can then share with uh, young people? Well, you would want to make sure that you've created a bookshelf. I've already created one, but you would just click on the plus where it says new bookshelf. So I click on S2 computing. I've already started making a template, but when you want to create your new book, all that you do is go to the top right where it says orange and new book. Um, and I would select the comic um, templates. Um, just because with the, ta the, the different kind of um, comic um, tiles that you've got there, you can add really, really quickly photos and videos um, for young people to upload. So we'll just go back in and we'll edit some of this here. So when you click on top right, the plus symbol, you get this menu here. You've got panels, which basically your page will be blank. You just pick the comic style panel that best suits your needs. There might be one where it doesn't actually suit your needs, but you can edit them really, really easily. So once you've chosen it, let's say I didn't want the top right panel, I would just click and hold. And when I click and hold, I get the option to unlock. So we can basically lock these panels in place so young people can't actually tamper with that. Um, the panel, um, they would have to unlock it in order to be able to do that. Um, all they would be able to do really is just kind of add in photos etc. So if I unlock, I can resize it if I want to. Depending on what I want to do. And just hold again and then just lock that back into place. If I place the plus symbol as well, I can add text. Again, this is kind of comic style. So you can just add your text. So I'll put, um, just put learning journal. my learning journey there and if I want to edit the text because I'm highlighted in I just click on the eye with the circle in the top right can increase the font if I want to and change the colour if I like and I can change the alignment whether it's centered whether it's right aligned I can change the background if I wanted to and go back okay you can also do the plus and you can add sticker text that's already there and it just really depends on how you want it to look um, and what you want to add to your to your template before you give it out to young people and you can add different pages again when you get to a blank space you can just click on the plus and you can click your panels uh, in whichever kind of grid that you want but once you're kind of happy with the template that you've got, um, the easiest way to kind of share that template so young people can start to edit it is through Shobi. Um, so if I go to the bottom right where it's uh, got the share button, and if I do export as EPUB, this menu comes up. Make sure that you select open in, and we're going to open in Shobi. If you go straight to Shobi, the, si the file size is too big. So that's why we would do open in. So I've got my class, go to my MS template, and I just put it into the assignment that I want. And I can select either sharing with everybody or just selected students. It really depends on what I'm wanting. So that's me added the file. Now all that it uh, leaves me with is just to check that it's there. So I'm checking on Shobi. This is the team here and it's in homework. Apologies, there might be about three different um, book creator but you can see it's been added there if you can see the top one it says just now um, so that's the template it's shared with young people all that they would have to do is download that 
open it into their Book Creator app on their iPad and then they can start editing their work. Uh, they can share it back, they can upload it onto Showbiz as a way of sharing or in Book Creator if they want to share the book um, they can publish it online that's an option that they can have publish online and they can basically make it private so only people with a link and then they can email you the link and then you've got access to their learning journal so that you can have a look at it as well so enjoy using book creator i found it really quite a simple thing to use especially on the ipad um, and it's a great way of tracking the progress of young people so have fun 